2nd Edges chapter 15, verse 16. For there shall be sedition among men, and invading one another. They shall not regard their kings nor princesses, and the course of their actions shall stand in their power. Double honors and salutations to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone that taught us this truth that rule well. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect and to the one third men, women, and children of Israel and to the Israelite foreigners who has the appearance of the heathens, but their lineage, their seed lines from their fathers goes back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Shalom, just the brother Hawashai Ibadia from GMS Chicago. And I saw this article, man. This, wow, this should be blasted all over the news, man. But it's not, all right? This, uh, I'm just going to jump right into it. This article says New York uh, Police Department cops leave, uh, leave force an alarming rate. Over 2,500 turn in badges so far. In uh, 2023, good man, you know, hey, and we know, you know, the the, the your banking elites, uh, you know, that run everything, Amalek, all right, Esau, Edom, the so-called white man, self-proclaimed white man. Remember, the earth is given into the hands of the wicked, Joe nine and twenty-four. So he's setting these things up. He, it, uh, the old playbook they use, all right, problem. Reaction solution. They've been running that same playbook for years, man. All right, and you know I'm not gonna go into the article that the title says enough, man. All right, so for time's sake, I'm just gonna uh, jump into it. And um, and you know this is coming to whenever something happens in New York, it's coming to Chicago, it's coming to L.A., all your major cities, man. All right, because guess what, Esau. Edom, he's done with the uh, police force. They're done with uh, white supremacy, all right, so-called white supremacy. As far as um, that, that uh, you know, Esau pulling Jacob out the car, you know, he's trying to bring in this new world order where, hey, we got to stop this and the police are getting out of hand. Hey, guess what? They, they're ready to implement the, the, the C-HIP, man, all right? A social credit score. So they're not going to need any officers, man. All right. They they, they, they got police dogs. Uh, well, uh, it's like your ro robotic police dogs, I meant to say. All right. You uh, people are being monitored every, in everything that they do, man. You're actually in a, a, a uh, Esau Edom is leading this thing into a, a digital prison. Where now you can't leave, all right? Then this is the, uh, the you know, with uh, Claw Swab and that Noah guy. They're um, setting up the, the, the fourth industrial revolution. So they're not going to need police officers or anything, right? So <clears throat> they bring the problem because you know once this happens, a crime is going to shoot up crazy. All right? Hey, you women that are at ease, oh boy. That's been, oh, man, I, hey, it's going to be crazy for you women, man. That's not what a man of the Lord, all right? You, your, your, your days are numbered all of this uh, vanity that you uh, do. But, hey, Lord, well, let me get that in the scriptures, okay? And your money is not going to be able to save you, man, in these times, all right? Let's grab, um, so let's start again with second address as we see the title of this um New York uh, Post, because when I saw it, I said, man, uh, is this real? You know, this was, yeah, November 25th. So let me start at uh, 14, second address 15, 14. Woe, which means destruction to the world and them that dwell therein. The sword for the sword and their destruction draweth nigh. And one people shall stand up and fight against another and swords in their hand, all right? The modern-day sword is a gun now, okay? Hey, but they're going to be having uh, machete, machetes too, all right? It says, For there shall be sedition 
All right, sedition means um you coming against the uh the the hierarchy, okay? The the the, the law. Let's just get the definition right quick. Um see conduct or speech enticing people to repel to rebel against the authority of a state or a monarch. All right? So if there are no police officers, what do you think is 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 going to uh happen then? Where is it at? Okay. Salakia. I know that was the brother that put it up. Um All right, so Salakia for that. Verse um, 16, it says, For there shall be, um, yeah, for there shall be sedition among men and invading one another. They shall not regard their kings nor princes, and the course of their actions shall stand in their power. A man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able. That's your martial law. Okay. That is martial law, man. You can't leave your house. Probably can't even go in your own backyard, man. They'll have drones floating over you. Hey, get back in your house, all right? Or they'll shoot you out the uh, shoot you with the drone, man. All right, somebody from their damn living room or something, right? It says here, for because of their pride, the cities shall be troubled. <laughs> and it's funny how that's twofold when it says for their pride. Hey, what is the uh? The, the 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 name of the alphabet community man pride okay but other than that these people here in america they're very very prideful people why because they follow after their oppressor esau edom the self-proclaimed white man all right that's the proudest set of uh of people of a uh, nation of people on this earth man why because the earth has been given into his hands all right it says here, um, the houses shall be destroyed and men shall be afraid. Why is that? Because when you call that 911, nobody's coming. A man shall have no pity upon his neighbor, but shall destroy their houses with the sword and spoil their goods because of the lack of bread and for, and for great tribulation. Okay, so you're going to have like group of marauders, man. People like those old, um, those police officers that retired from those forces, those police forces, hey man, they're going to band together, right? And another thing you have going on too with these officers, man, they're, a lot of them are taking themselves out, man, okay? A lot of them are taking themselves out, killing themselves, right? Let's grab here. The book of Sirach, which is also known as Ecclesiasticus, verse chapter 39, verse 28. It reads, there be spirits that are created for vengeance. Okay. Now we know everybody that's living got a spirit in them, right? And it's either a good spirit or a bad spirit. And the good spirit that the Lord is dealing with is the elect man, man. Okay of Israel which in their fury lay on sore strokes in the time of destruction they pour out their force and appease the wrath of him that made them because hey, sometimes you hear people say hey man I heard a voice in my head and I just killed 20 people at one time you know they heard a voice and that's true they do hear those demons in their uh, head talking to them right it says fire and hell and famine and death when nine one one don't work anymore, hey, that's 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 uh going to be a lot of death. And get, guess what, man? We're 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 happy when we see these things uh come about, man. Because you 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 Babylonians, man, you are us. Uh, uh, I don't care what race, whether it's uh Jake, all right, so called two uh not so called two third, but so called Negro Latinos and Native Americans. Of our people that don't want to repent and come back to the law, statutes, and commandments of the Lord to the best of their ability. They they shun the Lord. All right. They hate Yahweh Shai. 
All right, they're very proud, man. These uh, uh, these heathens that come from these other countries, the way they look at us, and of course, it goes without say. Esau, Edom, the self-proclaimed white man, he's the the the, uh, the the whole earth runs off of his energy, man. All right. It says uh, uh, fire and hell and famine and death. All these were created for vengeance. All right. Teeth of wild beasts. All right. And scorpions, serpents. Hey, and it's funny too. You know, it says teeth of wild beasts, right? Which are animals. But hey, these when you don't have the law, statutes, and commandments, all right, the Lord is not dealing with you. You're likened to a beast too, all right? Um, and the sword punishing the wicked to destruction, all right? It says they shall rejoice in his commandment and they shall be ready upon earth. When need is, so when a hey, all this man, people are just gonna be left out on the street, just dead. Ain't gonna be no funerals, man. There is no ambulance pickup. They just lay there like squirrels in the street, man. Roadkill, all right, stinking, De uh, decomposing, carnage everywhere. That's when women are gonna get, um, get in line immediately. All right. When need is, and when their time is come. They shall not transgress his word. All right. So, hey, man, these these spirits, man, these people are going to get busy, man. Right. Let's grab real quick here. Um, Isaiah. Isaiah chapter 32. And you women are going to feel the brunt of it. OK. Did you think that, um, you know, you could be strong, independent? I got my own stuff. I don't need a man, yada, 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 right? Hey, and even if you do got a man, if he's not a man of the Lord, you're screwed, all right? This is uh, Isaiah chapter 32, and um, I'm going to read. I'm going to start at 9. <laughs> I'll read it in the NLT. It says, listen, you women. Who lie around in ease. And that's America all day. The women in America. Babylon the Great, right? Listen to me. You who are so smug. Let's get this definition of the word smug. What do we have here? Having or showing an excessive pride. See that? In oneself or one's achievements. I got a PhD. <laughs> Self, these narcissistic women, man, puffed up, self-congratulatory. All right, hey, what the scripture says: uh, uh, the Lord do a uh, a new thing in the earth where a woman can pass a man. Roughly paraphrasing the scripture, right? Goody, goody, proud of oneself. <laughs> I'm all right, Jack. You know. <laughs> so yeah, man. Uh. Knows an air type woman, right? Verse 10, it says, In a short time, just a little more than a year, you careless ones will suddenly begin to care, for your fruit crops will fail, and the harvest will never take place. All right, you people depend, you women depend on the system heavily, man. You depend on your link card, you depend on, on, on Section 8. All right, you depend on Esau eat on the self-proclaimed white man. He gave you all those goodies, man. All right, and those things are going to be taken away. It says here, verse 11, tremble you women of ease. Throw off your complete, uh, compl compl well, complacency, all right? Strip off your pretty clothes and put on burlap to show your grief. All right, let's get the definition of this word compl uh, complacency. It says a fit, see, smug, a feeling of smug or uncritical satisfaction with one's self achievement. Okay, self at my admiration. Hey, what the scriptures say? Uh, in the last days, people, people will be lovers of themselves, roughly paraphrasing. Pride. See, that's slackness, lazy, careless, gloating. All right, that's how these women act. All right, your modern westernized woman, man, right? It says here, beat your breasts in sorrow 
for your bountiful farms and your fruitful uh, and your fruitful grapevines. It says, for your land will be overgrown with thorns and briars. Your joyful homes and happy towns will be gone. Wow. Amen. So, yeah, that's, um, what is that article again? That New York article. Okay. So, yeah, New York, uh, Police department cops leave force in an alarming rate. Over 2,500 turned in badges so far in 2023. You know, this is this supposed to be like a, a catastrophe, man. Okay? You, you got uh, uh, criminals, man, licking their chops. And then, they, guess what? They're going to let a lot of these guys out of prison too, man. You are going to have to have a divine protection in that day, man. Okay, to 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 um to help you in these matters, man. Right? Let's grab real quick here. Um let's grab Micah 7. Micah 7 and 10. It reads, Then she, this is King James, Then she that is my enemy shall see it, all right? And shame shall cover her, which said unto me, Where's the, uh, where's thy, uh, the Lord thy, uh, thy power? You know, you can see them moving their neck and waving their finger as they saying that. Where's your Lord at now? You know, <laughs> it says, where's the Lord thy power? My eyes shall behold her. Now she shall be, now shall she be trodden down as the mire of the street. Okay, let's get the definition of mire. extricate oneself all right pretty much uh, uh uh shit man stick in the mud all right scum man all right boo boo that's what animals are uh, uh, boo booing at okay um now let's grab the book of Isaiah, hey, because hey, when these things begin to happen, the men of the Lord, Lord willing, I'm of that number, and the men that teach the doctrine of Yahweh, why Yahweh Shai, man, hey, these are the days we are waiting for, all right, because we win when these times come. Why? Because we've been doing the work, we've repented, all right, and you're supposed to repent several times a day, man. You repent like you wipe your ass, man. All right, begging the Lord to forgive you of your sins, your secret sins that you don't know you're doing. All right, sins from past life, right? Let's grab um, Isaiah 13, verse 12. It says, and this is going into the destruction because it goes up into, um, you know, prophecies about Babylon. All right. And this is, you know, the Lord is going to destroy this place with nuclear weapons. But before it's going to be total mayhem on the earth man all right this is the judgment day right but it's going to get crazy out here before those missiles come out the silos right icbms it says i will make a man more precious than fine gold all right what kind of man is that going to be that's going to be an israelite man a, 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 a man of the elect all right it says i will make a man more precious than fine gold even a man uh, than the golden wedge of 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 Ophir. Okay. How do we know this? Let's go real quick here to the book of Ezekiel chapter 9. And verse 4. It reads, And the Lord Yahweh said unto him, This is the um, angels, all right, that the Lord talking to. 
said the Lord said unto him, Go through the midst of the city, through the midst of Jerusalem. All right, Jerusalem is a people before it's a place, right? And set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that sigh and cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. All right, and that's what we're doing when we go out onto the um, highways and byways. All right, preaching the word, telling our people to repent. All right, uh, telling uh, uh, these people in America about the uh, America is about to be destroyed by thermonuclear fire. The Lord is coming back to destroy this place. All right, making these uh, electrical epistles. All right, these videos. All right, prophesying uh, and proclaiming the coming of our Lord and Savior Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. All right, it says, and then that that we're the only ones doing this, man. Okay, well, who else is doing this? With the the hundred percent truth, right? And you go into that word mark. It means the wa, the men that are uh, exempt, uh, <coughs> exempt from the wrath of the Lord, man. Okay, that's the mark. So, verse five it says here, and to the others, he said in my hearing, go ye after them through the city and smite, which means kill. All right. Let not your eye spare, neither have pity. Okay. Slay utterly old and young, both maids and little children and women, but come not near any man whom the, is the mark and begin at my sanctuary. Then they began at the ancient man, which were before the house. Okay. So, um, the Lord is 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 sharpening that sword, man. Okay, it's gonna be a lot of mayhem. You're gonna have uh 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 Jake killing uh, uh Edomites, Edomites killing Edomites, Edomites killing Jake. It's gonna be hey, them them the other heathen nation, Ishmael, so called Arabs, and those East Indians, man, they're gonna be uh getting uh pillaged, all right, and destroyed. Okay, so hey, the men of the Lord pretty much at that point. The Lord is going to take us off the street. We're not going to be doing these videos anymore. It's going to be family of the word. You're going to be looking for, man, where are those men that had the dresses on that, the, uh, that we, we used to laugh at? That had Bibles in their hand. Where are they? All right. And you women, man. Oh, boy. See, look at that. A remnant prepared. It says, and in that day, seven women shall take hold of one man saying, we will eat our own bread and wear our own apparel. Only let us be called by thy name, that means your wife, all right, to take away our reproach, all right? When all holy hell is breaking loose, man, you're going to be looking for a, a, a man of the Lord for a while because you're going to see that he's not being touched. He has that mark of exemption from wrath, okay? The Lord is dealing with them. That's not just no any man. That's a man that's um, that the Lord has chosen from the foundation of the earth, man. All right? Let's grab the book of Job, chapter 5. And I'm going um, to start at 19. It says, He shall deliver thee in six troubles, yeah. In seven there shall no evil touch thee. In famine he shall redeem thee from death. So we're going to be eating good, Lord willing, man. We endure, right? And in war, from the power of the sword thou shalt be hid from the scourge of the tongue neither shalt thou be afraid of destruction when it cometh we reading it right now man at destruction and famine thou shalt laugh neither shalt thou be afraid of the beasts of the earth man like i say these people without the law statutes and commandments man they are like they are like unto beasts all right, and the animals going to be cool with us too. Hey, man, the animals going to be bringing us food. All right, the Lord can do whatever he wants, man. All right, <clears throat> and this is going to happen all over America, man. America is going to be turned into a third world, third world country, man. Thus saith the Bible, man. Okay. This ain't nothing. We just pulling up out of our asses and just saying stuff, man. This is prophecy. <laughs> See that wisdom shout in the streets that the Lord has uh, commanded us to come out to the highways and byways where, you know, main chief cor uh, course of, of commerce, man, you know, around shops, 
well, you see uh, where people are shopping and proclaim the Lord, man. His come heralding in the Lord, man. Okay? This is wisdom. Um, it's like your yeah, wisdom of Solomon. This is Proverbs 1 and 20. It says, wisdom cry without. She utter her voice in the streets. All right? Who would, who's doing that? The prophets, man. Okay? She cry in the chief place of concourse in the openings of the gates in the city she utter her words saying how long ye simple ones will you love simplicity and the scorners delight in their scorning and fools hate knowledge so when we try to tell these people hey you need to repent come at the law hey they laugh at us man but it's okay it's all good watch this turn you at my reproof behold i will pour out my spirit unto you I will make known my words unto you because I have called. How the Lord called through his prophets? He put the words in our mouth, man. All right. And it tells you, I just read the scripture. It tells you that in the second Ezra 15 verse one. All right. It says, because I have called and ye have refused. I have stretched out my hand and no man regarded. You know, they laughed and they got a dress on yelling at the sky. Okay. Verse 25, but ye have set at naught all my counsel and with none of my reproof. I also will laugh at your calamity. Now, is that going to be a big old ha 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 in the sky laughing? No, no, no. He's gonna, the Lord's going to laugh through his, uh, through his elect, man. Okay. He put the words in our mouth to, to, to tell you pe uh, people to repent. He's going to put the laughing in our mouth too, man. Be a lot of funny shit we getting ready to see, man. The Lord is going to put a stone cold gentleman spirit on us, man. It says, I will mock when your fear cometh, man. When your fear cometh and desolation and your destruction come as a whirlwind. When distress and anguish come upon you, then shall they call upon me, but I will not answer. They shall seek me early, but they shall not find me. See, the Lord is going to put us away. He's going to hide us. That's going to be the, that famine of the word. It's going to be too dangerous for us to get out there now. The doors of mercy have closed, man. All right? The spiritual ark is closed up. The elect is sealed, right? Revelation 7. Okay? And now that it's time for the Lord to open a whole can of whoop ass on this place, man. Verse 29. For that for that they hated knowledge and did not choose the, Lord, the, uh, choose the fear of the Lord. Yahweh. All right, hey, because the fear of the Lord, they, the elect, they got that. All right, that's the first step to wisdom. They were none of my counsel. They despise all my reproof. Therefore, shall they eat of the fruit of their own way. All right, these people think that their money is going to save them. Remember to tell you, richest profit not in the day of wrath, man. The money ain't going to mean shit. All right, and be filled with their own own devices whatever you put your stock into now while everything is good okay hold that same energy when the 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 the, the, the police ain't coming no more okay that's when they're going to martial law uh, a robot terminator out there man all right or those u.n troops that they're bringing through the the the, the, the border right now all right you people don't have a clue what's about to happen man for the turning away of the simple shall slay them, and the prosperity of fools shall destroy them. But whoso hearken unto me shall dwell safely, and shall be quiet from the from fear of evil. Okay, that's the elect right there, man. Because that's who all the Lord is coming back to save, man. Matthew chapter 24, verse 30 and 31. All right. That's Romans 11 and 7, all right? The election I've obtained it, but the rest were blinded, all right? So it will behoove you to repent and come back to the law, statutes, and commandments and watch GM, the apostles and elders of GMS, man, and get in line, all right? So with that, I pray this was edifying. Barakatea, hello, barakatea, shai, bashim, shalom.